You can be amazing, you can turn a phrase into a weapon or a drug. You can be the outcast or be the backlash of somebody's life. Okay, so why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself? Um, I've lived in Cedar Falls most of my life, and I began school at Southdale Elementary, and then I transferred to Hanson in like third grade, and that was kind of hard being the new kid and stuff, but it was going pretty well up until around like fifth and sixth grade when people started poking fun at me and stuff, like they would, I don't know, I was kind of smart, so people would make fun of me for that, like they didn't think that you should be intelligent, I guess, and people started making fun of me because of my race and like making jokes about that. So I kind of felt a little bit less confident in myself. And then I went to junior high and think I made some more friends, but people were still kind of mean. I mean, people are usually mean around this age, but um, I kind of gained more of a support system. So at the beginning of high school, um, I had a group of friends and some of the girls began to start making some bad decisions and we didn't really want to be involved with that so our group kind of split up and we didn't really think it was that big of an issue but then there was a lot of tension between the two groups and once again we just tried to ignore it because we really didn't want to start anything we just wanted to kind of go on with our lives like it was a new time we just wanted to enjoy it but that group of girls kind of took things really far um, they went so far as to vandalize my house, and they just, I don't know, I, th I guess their goal was just to make me like really uncomfortable, really unconfident, they just wanted to bring me down. And I guess it kind of worked, even though I didn't want to show it. I felt very like alone, and I wouldn't show them, I wouldn't show it at school, but at home I was very upset, and I didn't know who I could turn to or trust. Like, I had my family and stuff, but I was almost, like, humiliated to talk to people about it because, like, I didn't want to seem weak or, like, immature. So I just kind of kept to myself, and it was really hard going through that because, I mean, growing up is hard anyways, and then when people put all this pressure on you and make you feel like you're not as good as you are, you start to believe them. So for a time... I really struggled with that, but eventually I began to find friends that I could trust, and not only that, but I began to gain confidence in myself. I began to believe that I was actually, I should be treated right, and I mean, I do know that I have flaws, and I tried to work those out, but I also concentrated on some of the positive things about me, and overall I've realized that if I'm confident in myself, then other people will treat me right and be confident in me as well so um where have you found support throughout your journey um my family was actually there for me a lot like at first i didn't know who to talk to but my parents especially just kind of sat me down and said we're here for you and if you really feel comfortable we can even like you can transfer schools if you need to i just i mean not that i would but just that support really made me feel like I was important to them, and that really helped a lot. Um, I do have like a really close friend that I can talk to about it, and she supported me as well. So that was that made it a lot easier to get through. So, what kind of impact do you want to have in this group? Like, where do you, what kind of message do you want to spread? Um, through this group, I really want to show that girls this age are not alone and they can talk to people. I'm willing to talk to people and listen to their problems and help them get through them because I really just don't want people to feel the way I did and to feel so alone and almost like worthless. So I really just want to know that people want to let people know that they have support if they need it. And I just want to help other girls build confidence because that's really important at this age. Thank you for sharing.